Let me a little bit more uh, uh, gain there and reverb. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, I didn't get that one. Didn't Don't play too much. It's hard to see y'all. Relax. Yeah! Now I can see y'all. Now I can. Y'all having a good time this weekend so far? Y'all coming back tomorrow? Y'all coming back next year? Good deal. Bring some friends with you next year. We're going to have this thing every year. What about that? Another brand new bluegrass festival in Florida. Are we ready, boys? You get to our right, Evan? You get unit right there, Evan? All right. Well, they were back there in the warm-up room just getting about to it. And I hate to interrupt them, but we had to have them up here so everybody could hear them. No monster trucks to get in his way. Let's put our hands together. This is Larry Gillis and his hard driving bluegrass band.
Ready right here. Ready right here. Sometimes that happens. We got you now, Evan Rudy. Evan, you like a tight pair of bridges, ain't you, boy? show up there. Don't forget in two weeks uh, over in Donnell and Florida we'll be over there doing the With Coochie Backwater Bluegrass Festival. We work that show every year and uh, we'd love to have you come over and be with us. Let's get out of Key and D boys and do a little bit of Carolina Mountain Blues. I can 
still see the blue eyes of my dog. I'm going to make a ribbon, said the man. There he does he smile? Gene, does he smile? You can't see him. It's that bass neck right in his face all the time, ain't <laughs> This young man right here comes to you from Gatton, Georgia. It reminds me of me when I was 17 years old. I had that hunger in me to learn in and everything about music. Couldn't get enough of it. And I'll tell you what, folks, he does great. He does a great job. And for his age, you can't beat what he's doing here on the stage for you tonight. <laughs> Mr. Evan Rouge, Gotten Georgia. This is our banjo player, Larry Gillis. What are you doing, Mr. Evan? You are. No, sir, I wouldn't. Are you ready? I'm ready, Mr. Evan. <laughs> You 
Evan, I appreciate you letting me uh, take one with you there, son, every now and then. I'll guarantee you I enjoy it. Folks, y'all gonna be back tomorrow? Yeah. All righty. I'll guarantee you now, I enjoyed that that uh, wild game food today. What about y'all? Yeah. Who got into that? Woo, that's some good eating, wasn't it? We gotta sing the gospel, folks. We never do a show, on, a show without doing the gospel. And, uh, I think we're gonna do this one right here. We're getting the key of C. Right there. That young man is a real intelligent young man. I'm just glad he lets us play with him too, Ray. We're gonna do you one here called, I'll answer the call. thing that makes something good out of it. Ain't that right, Mr. Evan? Right. You ready to carry this thing out of here, Evan? Have you had a good time? time. Well, Evan, are you, are you like a tight pair of britches? Is that what you, what you always put it? I'm ready to reel. You ready to reel? Tell them about it, Evan.
towards the sunset of time, traveling the highway home, leaving this world of sin far behind. It was hard driving bluegrass band. What do you think? He just broke a string, but good old Roger Bass always comes through. What do you think? Hard driving bluegrass band. Folks, we appreciate this. The boy broke him a string there. My brother used to call it a broke a war. Give me a war, boys. He could change one between songs, right in the middle of a song. He'd pull it out in his back pocket. He'd be tuned up by the end of the song. He'd be ready to rip it in. You know, uh, folks, I've been out there tours 30 years. My brother quit me about three and a half years ago. A lot, a lot, a lot of folks ask me about it. You know, I sure miss him. And uh, like I tell everybody, you know, um, he just don't want to travel anymore, and then you can't blame a man for that. But uh, I think I got a great guy right here doing the lead for me, taking the guitar. I think I got a great guy on the bass. And uh, thank you, Ray. And uh, we, you know, we're getting a lot of shows, doing a lot of shows, cutting records, and. It's all going normal like it should again, you know. We got nobody in the world to thank but you folks. We appreciate you.
another one off the, the CD project. We just happen to have several of them back there on the table. Several. Several. Wow. We, uh, we we ordered something over two and we sold something under a million, so we still have some back there. We have uh, some CDs, some tapes, some other projects that David and I have done in the past. Dan has one that he did a few years back. We have t-shirts, we have caps, we have pictures. We have thingamajigs that you hang up back there. Salt blades. Yeah, Green salt blades. And, uh... Right from Merchant Hill. Butterscotch candy. There you go. <laughs> so, uh, come back when we get done. This will be our last set for the weekend. So, when we get done, come back and talk to us. <laughs> Rain. We had. I know we had plenty of that last night, but we're going to do a song that I wrote uh, two or three years ago called Rain. Rain. Are you ready? I guess. You got all the words now? Yeah. It's raining in the Okay. Let's do that again. Yeah. One more time. It's raining in Kentucky, well, it's afternoon. I'll be down in this and all that. Here I am, I'm calling mine, I pull up my retail. I close my eyes. Crossroads and a little white church fence out behind it. 
old mom was going through there one day, just wanted to play down a Cochran. And uh, something about the real place that was real peaceful. And uh, these words started coming to me. It tells a little story. Somebody that has found their family after a long, long period of time. So I hope y'all enjoy it. Hopefully this is going to be on our next CD. We've had a lot of requests for it to be. And, and it is a beautiful song. He's written so many, I can't remember all the words. You know, songbook after songbook. And so I have, I've not learned it all. So. Sorry. <laughs> Valerie and 
Becky and Chad come and help us out. And Bobby. I do. The only one left is Jay and I was born. Yeah. He might lose. <laughs> we can get Josie up here today. We might get Josie, yeah. But uh, we've had a good time. Got, uh, we've been down here almost 10 weeks. And uh, after next week at Auburn Day, we're heading back up to Georgia. Go back to work. And uh, be fun to get back home. Get ready for our festival. Get ready That's for right. our festival. Yeah, May. We've got all of you yeah. to go to our festival. Oh, yeah. May the 31st. Gillingsville, Georgia. And there's flowers and stuff back there. We would love to have you all. Yeah, Liberty Pike is the featured group that weekend, as well as James King. Uh, Pure and Simple. Who am I leaving out? Suggins Brothers. Suggins Brothers. And us. Riverbend. River 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 it a good festival. And the Bluegrass Stagecoach. Oh. All right. Red 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 Red
Yeah. 